what's up guys we're back with another video and today i'm going to be showing you how to uh, make an admin log script in with uh using basic admin essentials so the way it's gonna work um all right the way it's gonna work uh hold on all right guys i'm back um so what i was saying it's gonna um in your discord server it's gonna pop up as a little message like fly me it's but it's going to be like a bot that says it. And it's going to be in your own server. SpongeBob so. said fly oh me. Oh my god, dude. All right. Um, so let's just get on with it. All right. So first what you want to do is you want to go to your toolbox. And you want to type in basic admin essentials. The model should be here. Um... All right, and then there should be webhook for basic admin essentials. Uh, that should be a script right next to it, um, made by R under dash R. Don't get any scripts um, unless like they're from a uh, dev forum, but don't get any other scripts that you do not know, and unless they are made um, from R under dash R, because. Uh, I think he is the creator of this. And then, um, also created by the furry fish, but, um, it's in the toolbox as R under dash R. So, um, yeah. All right. So once you have those two, you want to uh, put webhook in plugins folder you probably already saw me do that but uh i didn't actually say it so um saying it one more time you want to put webhook script in plugins folder or else this will not work so you want to click uh you want to double click on the the script and you should come down to line 33 to 38 and you should see webhook url um, this is the only thing you should edit, um, and this too, I don't really know what this does, admin logs, but you don't really need to edit that. So, all you need to edit is webhook URL, and the, the, re the way you get the webhook URL is you come to your Discord server, you click the little plus, you make a new channel. Uh, I'm going to name mine admin logs, edit the channel, integrations, create webhook, and I'm going to name it uh, admin logs bot. Uh, you don't have to name it anything because it's not going to be a uh, name. You're, it's not going to show the name. Um, so, uh, sorry, I was going really fast, but... Um, All right, so once you're here, you should be here, unless you are actually going at the speed with me. But unless you're stuck here, you wanna click on copy webhook URL and then press the little X and come back to Roblox Studio and just paste it in a webhook URL in these quotation marks. And that should be pretty much it. Um, you wanna go to game settings. If allow HTTP requests, if is off you want to make sure to turn it on and um enable studio access to api services make sure to turn that on uh just to make sure that it's running well so and then you want to press save sorry um the save button like the save button will be blue um it's not for me because i already had the settings here i'm gonna press cancel but you press save um, and then that sh that should be pretty much it. It was that easy. You want to publish it to Roblox. And I'm going to go to the game. <laughs> um, maximize this. And once you're in the game, you should have your admin. If I do fly me... And then go to admin logs. It should say fly me. 
and the person who said it and what command they said um so that's pretty much how you do that you can also go to edit channel webhooks and you can change the um uh the icon or whatever on uh, general all right so that's yeah that's how you make it thank you so guy my god thank oh my god all right whatever whatever thank you guys so much for watching my video my videos um there will be more uh coming soon uh, I'll try to post as many as I can. Um, I just haven't been posting that much lately. And I'm sorry. Uh, feel free to subscribe to my channel. And make sure to like this video. And um, comment. <laughs> I forget stuff really easily. I don't know why. Um, but yeah, guys, thanks for watching my videos. Um, yeah, peace out.